Hello everyone, so today I am trying no more sculpt for the first time. I decided to sculpt a Lapras. This one is inspired on a drawing that I made a few years ago. So I wanted to go and try to possibly replicate it on 3D. Honestly, I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm just going with the flow and just watching a few other tutorials on how to use this software. Instead of the rocks that I previously had done, I decided to put some crystals on it. Try different shadings, try to make them look as crystal-y as possible. For the teeth, I had a little bit of trouble. I didn't know what I was doing, but I eventually managed to put a few of them there. Those swirly things that Lapras has on its uh, head. I don't know if they're ears or if they're horns, but I decided to just make them as horns. There's a few shadings here and there. I'm redefining. Making the eyes was... Uh, that was fun. So this is how it looks so far. And I was really proud of how this one turned out. For knowing little to nothing about the program, I guess it wasn't that bad. So this is when I made the mistake of fusing the head to the neck without making a backup. So when I went and did the remesh, just completely blurred out. I don't know what happened, but I could not undo my progress. I was debating whether or not to continue or just leave it like that. I was left with a bad pixelated Lapras. So that was a shame. I was very upset when this happened, but from now on, I'll make sure to do a proper backup before deciding to fuse certain parts together. So here is my headless Lapras. So I might give it a go in the future, I'm not sure. Maybe make a few other uh, sculpts or maybe Pokemon base or maybe retake this one. But for now, it's just too much work, so I'd rather just leave this as a learning experience. Hope you enjoyed me sculpting and failing at using Noma Sculpt. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next episode. Bye!